guys and welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I'm going to be doing a nice and fluffy twist out using this brand called Wakati. I don't know how to pronounce it. So I received these products from Treasure Chest. So they sent me these products this month to try out. They are a new brand. I believe they launched probably like a week ago. So they're very, very new. And they sent them to us to give honest reviews. A little bit about the brand. As I said, they're called Wakati. I have no idea if I'm pronouncing that right. But it says Wakati, meaning time in Swahili, represents a respect for where your hair has been and an optimism for all the places you want it to go. And I absolutely love that. Um, it just shows that they've actually put a lot of time and effort and thought into their products. So it's given me a good feel already from just by the name and its meaning. So I probably will explain each product as I apply it just because they, they have very specific ways to use the products. Although I didn't actually use it how they say to use it because I used the conditioner to pre poo first and then deep conditioned with a different product. But um, they got a very structured way to use products to get the best results. But yeah, continue watching, see how I get on. All right, so I'm starting off with dampened hair. I just quickly wet my hair in the shower and I'm sectioning my hair off into four parts. And I'm gonna begin by doing a pre poo using the conditioner. So I just go ahead and wet my hair some more, make sure it's nice and wet. And I'm taking the water activated advanced conditioner and I'm applying quite a bit of that into my hair and smoothing it into my hair. It says the Wakati activated conditioner is formulated to make detangling your natural kinks and coils a breeze. The patented finger comb removal formula provides high slip to unlock tight knots, smooth rough cuticles and to seal it in moisture. So I reckon this product is actually perfect for a pre-poo just by from what it says. Because when you pre-poo your hair, you need a product with a lot of slip. You need something that's going to make you detangling easy. And I really did like this conditioner for that very purpose. I actually have stopped using conditioner in my wash day routines because I don't feel like that's a necessary step. I just deep condition because I deep condition every week anyway. So there's no point in doing a conditioner and a deep conditioner. Especially if I'm pre-pooing and detangling my hair beforehand. So yeah, I really like this conditioner. I think this is probably one of my favourite products from the line. So I just applied the product, tangled my hair, and I twisted it back up. I did that on all four sections. And once I've finished, I just went and washed out the conditioner with the twist still in. And then I proceeded to do the shampooing with the twist in as well, so that I don't get my hair tangled again during this process. So next I'm taking the sulfate free shampoo. It says the Wakati sulfate free shampoo delivers a balanced cleansing to gently remove buildup while prepping your hair for optimal conditioning. And as you can see, the shampoo is sudsing up really well and I like my shampoos to suds up because that's when I feel like I'm getting the best clean. And I really like this shampoo because it wasn't stripping at all. It left my hair feeling quite nourished and moisturised still. And as you know, some shampoos out there, they can strip your natural oils. They can strip your hair too much to the point where it's actually damaging your hair. But this shampoo was really good. I would buy the shampoo again. I used a small amount in my hair and it started up really well. And it even allowed me to do a little bit of finger detangling as well which was good because I think the whole line is highlighted around finger detangling so yeah I was able to finger detangle with each and every one of the products I shampooed once the roots only with the twist in I washed that out and I took all my hair down and shampooed my whole head from roots to end so yeah once I finished with that I just went and washed it out so I'm just adding a little bit of water to my hair because I want my hair to be about 85% wet so this is the oil infused cream and it says the Wakati oil infused cream seals in the right touch of moisture for slip and added shine. Infused with nourishing oils, this leave-in cream locks in moisture to hydrate curls and helps control frizz. So applying this product was really really nice, it went into the hair really smooth, it allowed easy detangling, as you can see like I didn't use a comb in this part at all, wasn't needed, wasn't necessary. So I applied the product, raked it through my hair as much as possible and I was realising that I didn't get any clumping action or didn't get much clumping action from this at all. So I knew that I wouldn't be able to go for a wash and go. And I actually tried to do finger coils this time around as well and that was not working at all. So that's why I opted for another twist out this week. 
So if you're wondering why I'm doing a lot of twist outs, this wasn't even supposed to be a twist out today, but here we are. So the cream wasn't heavy enough to clump my curls, but it was very moisturizing and it left my hair looking really, really shiny. So yeah, I was pleased with that. Um, I actually really like the consistency of the cream. So before each twist, I applied the reactivating conditioning mist. It says the Wakati reactivating conditioning mist hydrates and refreshes curls for a smooth finish with added shine. So I'm not really a fan of like using mist spray products. I've never actually bought one because I don't understand what the purpose is with these mist sprays. Oh yes, and I did do one side using an oil as well just to see how the results came out. So that's what I'm doing in that video clip in the top right hand corner. I definitely will try out the cream again. I think it would be perfect for protective styles. But I do want to try it with a gel on top as well just to see if it will work well with a gel. So once I finished doing all the twists, I did lay it air dry quite a bit before I went to bed. And I went to bed with the edge scarf on and a hair scarf over top just so that I can get all the edges nice and flat. So that's all the styling done and we're on to the next day. So what I'm going to do now is I'm just going to take them down and show you guys the results. so that's all done so yeah before i separate i'm gonna fluff out my roots as you can see already it's getting more volume and then i'm going to part my hair off how i want it looking kind of crazy and just try and blend that part in more so once i've got it to how the placement that I want it, I'm gonna start separating. And I just do this by separating it small, small. Yeah, so the battery died. So this is my phone camera. Anyways, I'm gonna continue separating my hair. So this is what it's looking like so far. Nice and fluffy actually. These products are really lightweight. I don't know how, oh. My son's crying. Hold on, let me. Very cute. I've had these things on my side. <laughs> so, yeah, these are the results. Not too bad, not too bad at all. So, yeah, this is the side with no oil, and this is the side with oil. From what I can see, there is less frizz on this side, and this side looks a bit more dull. In this side here you can see like lots of frizz and that's probably because I'm due for my trim I'm actually going to do that next week because I can't leave it for any longer than this um, but yeah this side looks a bit more elongated than this side and overall it just looks better with the oil so yeah I would recommend using the oil with these products so my final thoughts on the products they work all right I'm not unhappy with the results at all. There's no flaking or anything like that. I probably would want a little bit more hold with this hairstyle. Obviously, I don't think I could do a wash and go with the products. It's leaving like a sticky residue ever so slightly. It's not like it's, it's not a major issue. Yeah, my hair feels soft and light. Like it's really nice and fluffy. So it'll be all right for spring and summer. For the winter months, probably not so much. You probably need something that's gonna have a lot more hold. Is it gonna work in humidity? That's another question. So would I buy these products? I'm not too sure at this point. I'll probably skip the styling cream just because it didn't really hold my hair. My hair feels soft and it feels healthy, but I know this is not gonna last me long enough. So I need to have it with a little bit more hold. I do like the shampoo and the conditioner though. The mist spray, I have no idea how I'm gonna use that after today. Uh, maybe to restyle it, maybe I'll use it then. Uh, so yeah, that's my review on the, I don't know how to pronounce it, Wakati. <laughs> Wakati hairline. If you are interested in getting this box from Treasure Tress, I will leave my link, my 10% discount load out. <laughs> 
I will leave my discount code down below. But yeah, guys, that's the end of the video. I hope you guys enjoyed the content. If you did, don't forget to give it a great big thumbs up and subscribe to my channel if you want to see any more content from myself. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Bye. Thank you.